This is the Lucid Air. Lucid is an electric car company that came into the market not all that long ago and has really changed the game. The Lucid Air is a luxury sedan and it comes in a number of trims. There is the Lucid Air Pure, the Touring, the Grand Touring, and the Sapphire, which produces 1,200 horsepower and is priced at $250,000. Lucid really gained traction when Peter Rawlinson, the CEO and Chief Technical Officer, joined from Tesla, where he had designed the Model S. From there, he helped to develop the Lucid Air, as well as batteries that are used by Formula E, which is the all-electric racing arm of Formula One. Lucid is known for producing sedans that have among the longest ranges of electric cars, but also deliver a lot of horsepower. The model that we're driving, the Grand Touring, has a 400-mile range and produces 620 horsepower. But if you move up to the Grand Touring, that has a 519-mile range and 800 horsepower. One of the things that's very iconic about Lucid is it is designed and built in the United States. They're headquartered in San Francisco, and that is where their cars are all designed, and then they're built in Arizona. Because they are California designed and owned, the icon or sort of the mascot of the Lucid is the California Grizzly. And you can find these Easter eggs throughout the interior and exterior of the Lucid Air. Lucid's design approach is really unique. They think about everything from the ground up. Chief of Design Derek Jenkins, who came from Mazda, brought a really fresh perspective to how they approach their interiors. The wide battery pack underneath the chassis of the Lucid Air creates a really large spacious cabin. In fact, the rear seat feels more like a luxury car or a car that might be chauffeur driven than one that you might want to drive yourself. But slide behind the wheel and you'll definitely want to be in charge. Everything there is really fresh and unique. The interior of the Lucid Air is notable for this screen here. So it's a curved single piece of glass and almost all the function inside the car is here or on this other panel here that's called the pilot panel. And the cool thing about this is you can actually move functions between this screen and that screen. And if you decide you don't want to see this screen or you'd like to access the secret compartment behind it, all you do is that to get it out of the way. And now we have this really nice large uh, compartment back here. To get it back, just tap there. On the steering wheel, we have basic controls here and some toggle controls here on either side. And we have uh, stocks for windshield wipers and for our gear selector. Really elegant and easy to use. One of the iconic things about the Lucid Air is its glass canopy roof. It's a glass panel that extends from the hood all the way up to the center of the roof line where there's a structure pillar and then more glass beyond that to the back window. Lucid's drive modes are smooth, swift, and sprint, which is maximum power and torque. And you actually have to click confirm to be able to use that. With all that power under the hood, Lucid rethought how drive modes work. So you can front load all of that horsepower, all of that torque, all at once just by flooring the accelerator. The exterior of the Lucid Air is really unique. It has a really beautiful, elegant, streamlined look to it. There's a really unique light signature that lights up when you approach the car with your key fob and sort of gives you a little winky goodbye when you walk away. By the end of this year, we're going to see the very first three-row SUV from Lucid. It's also been completely rethought from the ground up for function for families or people who just really need a large SUV, but still a four to 500 mile range on the battery and a lot of horsepower underfoot. <music>